Hey guys, I was thinking about a couple subjects which are debated uh, among HVAC people. And one of the subjects, I figure I'll break down videos on several different subjects. The first one I was thinking about, and I saw some comments uh, on a few videos, is about line set and changing line sets out. Now, this isn't line sets that have any issues. This is just line sets where you've had an R22 system and you're switching to an R410A system and you want to change the line set out because you think that's the right practice. Do you guys think that is necessary or required? Uh, my belief is it's not. I think the lines are just fine. We can kind of combine two aspects here and talk about flush at the same time. Do you have to use Pro Flush or RX11 Flush to clear a line set if you are reusing it when you're switching from R22 to R410A? And I also say nope. I I don't think it's even needed. I blow out the lines with nitrogen not to clear oil, just to clear anything out of the lines that has accumulated during the install. But the small insignificant amount of mineral oil on the lines does not concern me a whole lot. The counter argument I think would be that ester oil will will scrub and take some some of the debris off the side of the lines. And to me, I, I don't know, I just don't believe that flushing does the job anyway. So I don't think that's even an issue. Um, I'm interested to see what you guys think about it. Bounce the ideas off of you. Changing a system, going to a brand new 410A system, let's say it's 20 seer. It's an elite 410A system. Do you have to change the line set? Do you because mineral oil is bad? The contaminants in the line may damage your new system, or is it not a big deal that's been blown out of proportion um, just during the switch over from R22 to R410A? I guess I'm a little bit of a pessimist when it comes to having to change the line set. I don't think you have to. I don't think you have to flush, but I am interested to see what you guys think. Tell me what you decide. HVAC community.